What's up, guys? Baby Brady so Five back with you. Happy Friday. Uh, hopefully, this is going up on on the Friday, which is today. So, hopefully, this gets uploaded today. Um, been saving up some stuff from this week. Um, really waiting. If you watched last video, I say last video. So, um, I had an issue where I was uploading videos and they were uploading as private. And I didn't realize it. And then when I made all I think there were four of them straight in a row, my last four. Um, I made them all public, and it kind of rearranged the... Uh, I guess it rearranged the order, but it would have been the one that had this Josh Rosen in it. Um, let me see. Am I zoomed in? Nope, that zoomed in. So, I'm, I'm perfect. Um, I've got another tripod coming, so hopefully this camera crap can cut it out. Um but the, the last video that, that had that in it, I mentioned I had a card show as delivered and was not in my mailbox. Uh, filed a report. I guess it's a fine and missing mail. You can't fi file a claim on it because it wasn't insured, um, which is the entire purpose of insurance. Um, so I was just kind of at the whim of, you know, did you uh, post office deliver it wrong? Was it still at the facility somewhere? How did it get scanned? What happened? And I was kind of at the mercy of just somebody else between me and getting that card. I would be out my money. You know, it showed us delivered. Seller's going to keep his. PayPal's not going to pay out for it. eBay's not going to pay out for it. Uh, post office is not going to pay out for it. <sighs> say all that to say, uh, second to the last package that I'm going to go into today was that card. It was returned in my mailbox. And on there it says that there's a little note from whoever it was delivered to. Wrong address. And it's pointing to... Um, pointing to my zip code, so they, they delivered it incorrectly. Um, the person who, who put it back in the mailbox and put that note's not going to see it, but uh, just a general thank you for being an upstanding citizen. Um, I get my neighbor's mail all the time. That's a lot easier to deal with. Um, he took the time, or they took the time, to put, it, put on there. This was delivered wrong. And either went down to the post office or put it back in their mailbox to be re-delivered. Um, either way, not an effort that they had to that they had to put in, but just a, a general thank you to to people like that to that person. Thank you for getting this package, regardless of the contents, back to the party where it was supposed to go. Um, really do appreciate that. Um, great job. Anyway, we've got a lot of stuff to go through today. Just like the the last video, or I guess my most recent mail day is what I'll call it. The one to Josh Rosen and. Uh, some of the basketball cards. Um, I went ahead and cut cut these open. I haven't cut the cards out of anything. Um, so they could be taped up and whatnot. Um, so I'm going in order of in order of how I received these in the mail. Um, which I think started on I don't think I had anything Tuesday. I think it started on Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday and Thursday were two of my big days, and then I just had one thing in the two things in the mail today. Um, this is number to ninety nine. Uh, thank you for putting this in a magnetic holder, given the uh, I guess gravity of the card. But um, silver refractor, rated rookie auto, Sony Michelle. Um, e even while he was at Georgia, he was one of my favorite guys to watch. And shoot, he's in New England now, and he's still one of my favorite guys to watch. Uh, he, he's one of those guys, you know, you draft your fantasy team and, you know, you draft a rival player and you're like, well, I hope he does good, but I don't, you know, I hope the rest of the team sucks. That's kind of how I've, how I've used Sonny Michelle and I've always looked at him. Um, honestly, that's how I've always looked at Georgia running backs. Like, I always liked Todd Gurley, always liked Nick Chubb. Um, the, the, guy, the guys now don't have as, uh, you know... That, that they don't have the character. I say character. They're not bad people. That they don't have the personalities. Is the word I'm looking for that those those guys did. Um, so you just saw the the Rosen, and I may have mentioned in that video. Might not be the last one. Um, this one's number to fifty. Red refractor. Um, I I don't really know why I'm snatching Josh Rosens. They, I guess it's because they look really really cheap compared to the other quarterbacks in the class. And I've just got a good feeling about him with Cliff Kingsbury. Um, they, they just brought over 
Uh, I, I think they're looking at bringing in Steve Sarkeesian, um, getting Christian Kirk back, and I, I've heard that they're going to stick with him. There, there's talks about Cliff Kingsbury moving Josh Rosen to get, uh, you know, to, to move up in the draft to go get Kyler Murray. We'll see if that's the case. I've heard the suitor for Josh Rosen is the Giants. Um, if that's the case, if he goes to the Giants, Josh Rosen's cards skyrocket with the rest of that team, the rest of that offense. He's a shoe in to do well there. Um, so I, I, I just long story short, I guess that's why I'm kind of pulling in some of the Rosens. <sighs> Next card, he plays for the local team. He's on my fantasy team. This was a great card, too good to pass up. I had an eBay Bucks voucher, um, so I went ahead and bought this and hopefully one of the other cards in here that is also basketball. Um, I don't plan on getting any more Kembas. I don't plan on getting any more of the next guy, um, the, the next basketball guy. I don't know if it's the next package, but um, it's not. Let me see if I can find it. We'll go through single card lots until, until I find it. This is not it. We'll get right to that. Sorry, guys. This is happening off screen, and I'm just going through going through these packages, seeing if the card I'm looking for is in here. It may not have been delivered yet. I don't know if I remember seeing it. Mark is delivered. Whew. Okay, so it did not get delivered, so I'll just I'll start with what I just opened. Um, Naheem Hines, Aqua, rated rookie auto. That is number to 75. Put, putting together the 2018, pretty good. On the next one, I am not thrilled with the shipping on this. There is no penny sleeve. That is an issue and will certainly deduct from the rating I give this seller. Um, yeah, that's extremely disappointing. Anyway, number to 25. Let me see. I don't, I don't have an extra sleeve laying around, I don't think. I don't even want to put it back in here. Uh, Ray Allen, Supersonic Jersey, auto, number to 25. This is my favorite basketball player of all time. Uh, hands down, no questions. Um, the only person who's even remotely close right now is Clay Thompson. This guy is my all-time favorite basketball player. Just a, you know, good person. Um... Loved watching him play. He was a three-point specialist before that kind of existed. Him and Reggie Miller um, kind of occupied the same space, but um, Ray Allen just had more postseason success than Reggie Miller ever did. Uh, helped that he was on that big three uh, Celtics team. You could almost call him big four with Rondo. Um, and then obviously the I think he won two with LeBron. Here's the card that was re-delivered, and uh, you'll see why I was upset about not having it here um, and just kind of being out, you know, quote-unquote out what I paid for it. Um, Calvin Ridley, Aqua, Raider Rookie, Auto, kind of a simple auto, but looks kind of cool. You can tell there's still a little bit of effort in it. Um, number to 75. So that's one of the bigger players to get for that set. Um... And someone I think is also going to go up in value. I've, I've kept an eye on his stuff to see if anything slips past some people. Um, this was a lot picking up mainly PC stuff. But then there's uh, one investment card in there. Um, but I, I like the players on it. So, you know, even if they kind of bust, they're just never worth what I paid for it. I'm not really that upset. Um, but to start, so this is, this is all from one purchase I made on blowout cards. Um, I want to say this was less than 100 bucks for the entire thing. So a DJ Chark, Jersey Auto, number to 49. DJ Chark, Origins, on card auto. Not numbered, but um, if you watch the channel, you know my love of Bear with Origins. Um, turn of the Century, number to 149 out of Elite. Autograph of Naheem Hines. Go pack. Let's see, we have two cards in here. First card, the University of Tennessee, John Kelly. 
who's the quote unquote backup to Todd Gurley, I guess. But they they went and picked up uh, C.J. Anderson, and I think he had a pretty good time. So, um, you know, nothing bad for John Kelly. He's a rookie. Um, he just happens to be behind the best running back in football. And then we have Jalen Samuels, purple ink autograph, number two fifty. Uh, 32, sorry. Uh, 5 of 32. I read it upside down. Um, and then the big card from this, number 3 of 15. Whew, really sweet card. I didn't realize the, the top one was a two-color patch. Um, this is out of mm, Phoenix. Calvin Ridley, Christian Kirk, DJ Moore. Triple auto. It, dual two-color patch, but triple patch. That's a prime jersey. Um, these are all player-worn, but number three of 15. So we didn't hit a jersey number on there. Um, the only ones we could have hit were DJ or Christian Kirk, but they're 12 and 13. Um, regardless, love that card. And let's see. We got one more lot. Okay, some decent stuff in here. Oh, throwing everything everywhere. I don't even know where to start. Okay, cool. This guy threw in what I asked him to. He didn't have to at all. Um, but there was a post on Blowout about someone who busted a bunch of Optic. They had their hits, you know, for sale, obviously. Um, so na naturally, I go raid. <sighs> okay, we'll see about those. Um, but I, I asked him, I said, you know, if it doesn't hurt you in shipping too much... You know, I'm trying to collect the, the set, all, all variations of it. Like, I'm in love with it. You check my post. That's all I'm buying. That's all I'm looking for. Um, and he threw me in uh, Raider rookies. Carryon Johnson, Christian Kirk, Anthony Miller, Courtney, uh, Cortland Sutton. So there are a couple of Bradley Chubb. I haven't seen this card yet. DJ Moore, Sonny Michelle, Rashad Penny. So shout out to you, dude. I'm trying to remember who you were, what your username was. Um he never responded, said he was going to. Um, not, not not saying that in a bad way, but that's awesome just to throw those in there. He definitely did not have to do that. Um, so we'll start first. I bought two redemptions. One of these, let's see, this is uh, the red autograph redemption of Carrion Johnson. That's going to be a killer card, guys. Killer card. And then uh, just a regular rated rookie of Denzel Ward out of Ohio State. And then we have the actual hits. I say hits, um, numbered cards or autos. So let's see how we put these in here. Uh, first one, this guy is just incredible. Great story. Everyone knows it. Um, Aqua, Otto, Shaquem Griffin. Love this guy. He, he's such an inspiration to so many people. Um, you, you, you can't not root for the guy. Uh, let's see. Number two, 85. Once you start getting into some of these parallels, like this one doesn't look impressive at all. Like It just looks like a regular chrome, what you would expect a base chrome to look like. But it's number to 85. James Washington. And this one, number 99, is more sh is shinier, but higher number, uh, Darius Fountain. Uh, number to 150, which in my opinion looks identical to the one that was just numbered to 85, uh, John Kelly. Number to 125, which I'm not even going to repeat myself. We just had, we had four cards. All of them silver bordered. All of them numbered to something different. Uh, anyway, that last one was Ian Thomas for the Panthers. He got a little bit of playing time with Greg Olson getting hurt. Um, then we have two of my favorite cards in this entire lot. Uh, this is like a black velocity, I think is what they call it. Jalen Samuels. And that is number 25. And we have my first of this parallel this year. PC player of mine, well, semi-PC, uh, Naheem Hines, gold, number 9 of 10, sweet, and then we have Josh Allen, 
There's some other stuff in here, but this one's right on the front, and I just want to get right to it. Number 99. This is one of the chase cards for the set. I think other than Chubb, Darnold, Baker, and Lamar Jackson, this is the next hardest card to get. So, great to get someone who pulled it and had a bunch of other stuff that I was already looking for. Like, none of these are duplicates. None of them. Um, Anthony Miller for the Bears had a great rookie year. Great rookie year. Number 99. Um, I think he'll make the all-rookie team. I don't know if they come up, come out with that yet, but he's got to be he's got to be in the running for that. Um, number 99, Ronald Jones. Looking for more out of him, to be honest. Um, hopefully with the new coaching staff, we'll get more out of him. Um, Kiki had a touchdown in the playoffs and a losing effort. Go Colts. Number to 75. Uh, number 8 of 99, Naheem Hines. So we, we had the aqua of his earlier. Now we have the regular. And you know, I'm not looking to, to do that with all the players in the set, but those are just, you know... Uh, Naheem Hines, Jalen Samuels, John Kelly, those guys I'll probably try to build towards the collection, but like my life's goal is not going to be, I got to finish the Naheem's, Naheem Hines rated rookie rainbow. You know what I'm saying? Um, number to 35, this is the purple. Alex McGuff, McGuff, McGow, don't know, never heard of him, honestly. I don't even know where he's from. FIU, okay. FIU too. Um, and then probably the biggest player out of that set, other than Josh Allen, the Aqua Cortland Sutton, which I'm trying to stock up on some of his stuff too while it's a little low, because I think once they, you know, I think next year is going to be a good year for the Broncos. Um, let me see, where did I stop? I want to show visually everything we got in today. I say today, the last couple of days that have st stacked up. And then Raider rookie set. So um, that's what we're looking at. Haven't got in. That's a super sweet card. A lot of great cards in here. Um, my spending spree might be done for the month, just as uh, some of the mid year, really the, the mid month bills come due. I want to make sure I have that set aside and just. Uh, um, I'm actually buying tickets, I think, to go to Elton John here at the end of the year, but I got to buy them now because he's on his farewell tour. Um, so I'm going to put a, be putting a little money towards that to get my seat. Um, but other than that, I'm still I'm going to stay hot. Guys, there's a lot of stuff still coming in. I know I say that at the end of every video, but as you can tell from these cu past couple of videos, I'm not lying. Stuff is coming in. So like, comment, subscribe, share this, and guys, I will catch you next time.